Welcome. Today we'll be exploring A-Drive, a cloud backup and storage solution for businesses. This review is brought to you by Technology Advice and the Smart Advisor tool, which lets you compare 50 cloud backup and storage companies in under two minutes. So A-Drive is primarily um, an online-based storage provider, and this is the page that you'll see when you open up your account. They offer a free trial, so you can check it out, um, even their business accounts, which we've signed up for here, 200 gigabytes with 10 users. Um, they offer a complete full trial. So if you want to upload files, just go to the My Files, and this is their web-based uploading interface. You can look at your files that you already have on there. You can create directories and um, you can share directories to other users, and you can upload as well. If you want to upload a file, you simply click the Upload File button here in the upper right-hand side, and this will open up a drag-and-drop interface, or you can browse your computer manually. That's pretty simple. There's also uh, my status, which we were on before. This is going to show you how much of how much space you've used of your account, how many files and folders you have, the different directories, and it'll allow you to manage your account settings and manage your users. The Learn tab at the top is going to give you an overview of A Drive services. They have some tutorials um, for their desktop. FTP uploading, the remote access, and they also have apps for Android and iOS that allow you to back up phones. We'll show you the desktop version now. So while A-Drive is primarily a web-based program, they also offer a desktop program that is uh, based on Adobe Air. And there's a download link on their site. It's free. And it's a pretty basic. It's actually simpler than the web tool. Um, it's just going to show you your current usage, so how much storage space you have left, your files and folders, and then it'll give you a tool to upload. You can choose any local file or folder, and then you can uh, choose a remote folder of the one of the directories you've made online to upload it into and a, a download tool for downloading anything from their web interface. There's also um, a way to manage the backups that you've established um, and you can create new jobs which are simply uh, jobs are just automated or scheduled backups for certain folders. Uh, you can edit current ones and you can view an entire log of the jobs that you've had and the downloads that you've completed. So the desktop version is really just a way to manage what you've set up on their website. So the upsides of A Drive are it has a really simple interface. As you can see, the web interface is pretty intuitive and the desktop version is very simple. Um, the web-based uploader also is nice in a way because pretty much any computer that you're on, you can connect to your account and you can download files from that or you can upload files. So it's not tied to specific desktops. Um, they also offer iOS and Android apps for backing up your mobile devices, um, which is great for businesses that have a lot of people on the go or feature a lot of travel. The downsides for A-Drive, um, it can be a little overly simplistic. It's not immediately apparent how to create scheduled backups that recur um, automatically every day, for instance. Um, also, their file versioning and some of the more technical features are a little hard to access. Um, and their default interface is web-based, which, while it's a pro in some ways, is also a con, because um, it offers a little less flexibility and the feature set on their desktop isn't quite as robust as some of the other ones we've looked at. So thanks for watching. Before you make a decision, make sure to go through the Smart Advisor on technologyadvice.com where you can compare over 50 cloud storage and backup companies in under two minutes.
Thanks for watching this review of A Drive.